underwater data centers are relatively new concept, but they offer a number of potential benefits over traditional land-based data centers. One of the biggest advantages is they can be cooled using the surrounding seawater, which is much more efficient than traditional air cooling system. This can help to reduce the energy consumption of the data center and make it more environmentally friendly. Another advantage of underwater data center is that they are less susceptible to natural disasters such as earthquakes and floods. This is because they are located deep underwater where they are protected from the elements. Additionally, underwater data centers are less likely to be targeted by cyber attacks as they are more difficult to access than land-based data centers. There are a number of challenges associated with building and operating underwater data centers. One of the biggest challenges is the cost of construction and maintenance. Underwater data centers are much more expensive to build than land-based data centers and they require specialist equipments and personnel to maintain them. Another challenge is the risk of leaks or other accidents that could easily damage the equipment or contaminate the environment. Despite these challenges, underwater data centers are promising technology that could have a significant impact on the future of data storage and processing. They offer a lot of benefits over traditional data centers and they are becoming increasingly popular as the demand for data storage continues to grow. In this video, I tried to explain why the data centers is located under the seawater. So hope you like my video. If you like my video, please comment below on the comment section. This is my first video in English. So if I did any mistake, please pardon me. Thanks for being with me. Please follow my channel and subscribe my channel on YouTube. Take care of yourself. Bye bye from Kikorajai.